Zoom in. Whoop, oh, too far. Maybe. Gone too far. We'll make it work. Okay. So, first of all, happy Thanksgiving. Um, we're live early tonight because, well, we have a lot of potatoes to make. So, yeah, we do. <laughs> um, but I didn't want to just skip it. And it is the night before Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving so, Eve. Right. So, we're going to be doing a turkey pour. And for those who don't know what a turkey pour is, you will know very shortly. Yeah, you will. So we're just picking out our colors and let me go ahead and get the comments pulled up on my computer. There we are. Hello, hello everybody. Hey Katie. Hello. Say hi in the chat box. I guess this is some white paint we can use. <laughs> hey Leonard, hey Jenny, hey Karen. Welcome everybody. Gobble gobble. <laughs> Happy turkey day. Okay, we're using 14 by 14 inch canvases, which I feel like is maybe a bad idea, but we're gonna do it anyways. Yeah. <laughs> um, and I'm not sure, I think these ones are smaller, so I'll use these ones. You know. Yeah. Okay, so you get the bigger. Huh. You only really need one, but you can use as many as you want. I, use, I like to use 10 personally, five <laughs> layers per hand. Oh, we might want cups. Cups are a great idea. Hold everybody. Your cup is very important to us. 16 ounce cup? Um, any cup, really. Any cup, okay. So, <laughs> general obviously I've moved everything over to my new space pretty much. Hey Jamie, hey Linda. Texas was amazing. Hey Chris. I had so much fun. No, those are too dirty. Uh -huh. Okay, one second everybody. We will figure it out. We can work it out. We can work it out. And I have out. a whole bag of pine cones Ooh. for some reason. Can we use them? We're doing a turkey for you. Turkey. Oh, that's right. I already forgot. I got excited. I saw pine, pine cones. I keep wanting to call them acorns. Don't know why. Ooh, look. Also a whole box of pine cones. Whoa, that's useful. <laughs> okay. There's got to be some cups underneath here that we can use. What well, are we doing? Clean for? Um, yeah. I'm gonna use this. Oh, we have split cups. Oh, true that. Split cup. Split cup. Okay, we're gonna use split cups. <laughs> yeah, Jenny, we had so much fun. So much fun. I loved hanging out with you. And Brandy, is Brandy here? <coughs> grab another split cup. So we're super cooper at. For 14 by 14 inch canvas, you need, I'm just guessing, 12, 12 ounces-ish? I can use my calculator. Oh, yeah. I'm not, Those things. I need to do a map in my head. That just Those out. things. All right, let's see. So Ooh, these geez. are 10 ounce split cups. 14 by 14, then divided by 16, is it? <laughs> you need enough paint. Yeah. Yeah, 12 and a quarter. That was pretty good. Nice. Oh, thanks, Veronica. Johnny got it first. Ha, ha, ha. <laughs> thanks, Leonard. Yeah, everybody, thumbs up. Feel free to super chat or super sticker. And if it sounds like my house is about to blow away, that's because it probably is. It is so windy right now, it's not even funny. We're okay, expect, so expecting to make a bunch of the West any second. Start now. filling up your cup. I know. We okay. might end up in Kansas. So for any of you that are from Kansas, we'll see you soon. Let's like. wait for grabs. Yeah. Use? Okay. Go for it. I didn't know because it's on the whole so I didn't want to be presumptuous. I don't know where it came from. Uh, it was just there. Huh. Okay, I kind of grabbed six random-ish colors. Ooh, the good ones. Yeah. So I'm gonna have like a little hint of Thanksgiving in here, uh, with also not. <laughs> I'm not even worrying about Thanksgiving myself. <laughs> I just grabbed colors I liked. And I'm going metallics on one side, non-metallics on the other. Let's see what that does. I will definitely add Idaho on my list to consider. To be honest, I want to do like a U.S. tour. Yeah, it feels like the house is literally going to blow off the hinges. It doesn't, it doesn't have hinges. No, it doesn't. Well, well it has doors, doors. The doors have hinges. So, sure, I'm going to stick with my original story. Yeah. 
All right, so these, we're both using 10 ounce split cups. Thank you so much, Rhonda. Buffalo is 100% on my list. Although it might not be actually Buffalo, it might be like Rushford or Trumansburg or something, but it'll be Buffalo adjacent. Yeah. yeah. I just, I just, you know. We'll figure, we'll figure out a Buffalo trip for yeah, sure. Yeah, we'll, we will figure it out. Johnny's from Buffalo. From Do you guys know that? Is, yeah. From the b 716 in the his house. OMG. Okay. <laughs> Lasagna and birthday cake. Yes, please. What? Mine's in February. I'll take it early. Okay, so what is everybody making for Thanksgiving? Let me know in the chat box. We do potatoes. I've done potatoes for like the last 15 years. Um, I do generally two t two kinds, but I end up making this massive vat of mashed potatoes. That's my favorite. Okay. We don't have any other pearl white here, do we? Highly doubtful. Okay, fine. Well, I'm going to use... No, I'm going to keep metallic on this side. I'm going to stay true to my word. Mm, do whatever you like. All the carbs. <coughs> Turkey right. and green beans. Ooh, I like green beans. Green beans are one of my favorite thingies. I like... Um, she does like the green bean casserole. Yeah. The funny thing is, and don't hate me, you guys, I'm really not a Thanksgiving person. Ooh. I don't really like stuffing. I don't like cranberry. I don't really care for turkey. I actually don't even care for mashed potatoes. <laughs> um, but I do like pie. I do like green bean casserole. And I like the Brussels sprouts. We have Brussels sprouts. I don't know if that's a normal Thanksgiving thing. It should be. I agree. Ooh, a homemade mac and cheese. Okay. Ooh, I would giggity. Definitely get into that. <clears throat> All right. So we're filling these up to 10 ounces, which means we'll just need probably a little bit more. Okay, so. <laughs> Well, Stephanie, probably because it's usually made too dry, the stuffing. Otherwise, I think I would like it. Yeah, this is a, a split cup. And it has two compartments. All right, so a turkey pour was inspired by, uh, you know, when you draw a turkey around your hand at Thanksgiving when you're little. <clears throat> and I was like, what happens if you do a pour over it? So it doesn't have to be, uh, it doesn't end up looking like a turkey at all. Negative. Let's eat and some mo things. Hello. Um, but basically, we're going to just be pouring over our hand. Oh. And it does create this very funky sensation. <clears throat> I'm just adding a couple extra ounces to make sure I have enough. Same here. I'm going to use white for my couple extra. And then here we go. Ooh, that cold. <laughs> so make sure to get it over all of your fingers. And this is such a fun one to do with like the whole family. You can get a bigger canvas or like a group of friends. You can get a bigger canvas and everyone can put their hand on there. I think mine's going to look like Christmas. Yeah, right? I don't know what mine's going to be. Something. But yeah, it's just fun. Just fun. <laughs> I know these colors are weird like definitely not my usual but I really just picked like six random ones out of this box so that it could be something different hey CJ all right and for just a reminder in case anyone hasn't been paying too much attention we do have some Black Friday sales still going. You can get 5% off of resin and resin kits. You can get 20% uh, off a of Fluid Art That Sells course. And then also the new resin art course is still on a special early bird discount through Friday. So maybe if Veronica is listening, she can get you those details, I hope. Because my hand is covered in paint. I like to let it sit for just a minute so that the colors can kind of seep off and then just pull it straight up. Ooh, I'm going to let mine sit a little more because I add a little purple there. Okay. And then I'll usually just take the glove and wipe off any of the paint on the edge. Real. Yeah. All right, here we go. Here we go. 
My table's so clean. I don't want another one. Yeah, they're not going to last. All right, so the Charming Giraffe is going to get you guys these links. And then I'll make sure to post them in the video description later. All right, we have three minutes. Guys, we're going to be ending off in three minutes, just to warn you. Okay. We have a, a very important date. <laughs> yeah, we do. <laughs> All right, time to tilt, yeah? Yeah. There it goes. Here we go. Look at these colors. I know. I also went kind of unusual. I never use as much yellow. I know. Well, you use Golden Sun, yeah? Yes, which yeah. really pervaded. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It took over. Okay, mine's less Christmassy than I thought. I thought it was going to be a little more. But uh, the red and the white got together and made pink. So it's a little mm. less Christmassy and still somewhat a little earthy. Because I've used a lot of that sand color. I'm going to just bring it back this way a little bit. And I'm moving mine over here away from you. I'm definitely glad I added that purple. That's working out. Look at that. Wow, you're done before I am. <laughs> what happens. I was in Texas. I got back on Monday. Had a really fun three-day workshop. Katie says she likes that yellow and purple, Johnny. Yeah, that worked out. I was, I'm that is actually really pretty. Pleasantly surprised. By... Yours has a mermaid in it. Cool. Where? Where's she, she at? She's in there. Yeah. Is she a good-looking mermaid? I have no idea. I really hope so. Okay. I do have paper towels. <laughs> There's Johnny's head in the camera. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Hi, guys. Uh, oh, geez. all right. Oh, so I'm, I'm going to bring you guys in for a close up. And pay attention because the Charming Giraffe is posting all of the important links. We import them. Here, let's go ahead and get yours raised up. Wait, let, me make, let me find four before. Oh, I only have three. I just oh. had four. You keep asking me questions. There. I don't have the answer to. Okay. All right. Lift. It doesn't want to come up. Oh, there we go. Okay, one more. <laughs> okay, and I'll find the four for mine in just a minute. Okay. So let's do our close up. Yeah. Mine has a laughing face. I can see oh, it. Oh, it's totally different from this side. Yeah. So see, if you look at it upside down. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> well, it's also a, totally a bird in here. Okay. It's going to shake. And then roll. Yeah. So just close your eyes. Hold your stomachs. Here we go. All right. So here's mine. Very funky colors. What do you guys think of this? I do really like this here, though. I'm feeling it. It's actually pretty soft, which I like. With nice, um, that purple is really providing some fun contrast there. Hey, Annabeth. And then here's Johnny's. Lots of metallic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you used um, some metallics that really do tend to take over, including mm -hmm. the uh, fairy spit and the golden sun. Yeah. And then copper and sapphire, which are also... Copper can be a bit subdued. Oh, and the, the chocolate magic, too, which kind of laid back. Yeah, laid back. It did lay back. With mine on its money and its money on its mine. Oh, geez. Okay. <laughs> Super fun. That just happened. All right, you guys. This um, concludes our shenanigans for today. Picasso for Journey Cup Part 2. <laughs> So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm glad you guys could come spend a little bit of time with us before your Thanksgiving madness. Please make sure you take advantage of all of the Black Friday sales. Thank you, Jenny. Um, enjoy your family time. And we'll see you all next time. Bye.